or ask your important questions at donandgino.com. Now, back to your friends, Don and Gino. We're going to have lots of friends here in the Media Studios right here at Cherry Creek Morgan and on the, your hometown station, AM 1223 HBS. Don Gatling, Gino Fonti, and the one and only Taylor Viner. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the Predator right here. Uh, one of our top mortgage professionals uh, here at Cherry Creek Mortgage, and we're proud to have you join us, buddy. Thank you for having me. I got to give a big shout out to all the moms listening. Happy Mother's Day! Woo-hoo. Happy Woo-hoo. Mother's Day! Happy I, Mother's Day, mom! And my mom would like to tell you guys she loves the vault. She texted me and said that it, it looks amazing. So she's clearly she's watching talking online. About you, you realize that nice. she's such a proud. No, mom. she she <laughs> mentioned the Cherry Creek banner. Uh, okay, she's actually watching. So we have two listeners now. <laughs> <laughs> now, we, we appreciate you joining us every week. And if you want to get some great information, go to our, our website at donandgino.com, D-O-N-A-N-D-G-I-N-O.com. When you can click on the Listen Chat Live, join us live. This is a live show, so it's up to date as much as possible. That's why you get the Don Getling blooper show every week. Like that one. Yes. <laughs> and uh, on top of that, you can li- go to our YouTube channel. There are a hu- over 150 shows now, uh, 350 clips. Thanks to Shannon, our producer, putting those things up. And thanks to Furman making us look good because we actually have three HD cameras on us every week. Uh, a little too close for comfort for Gino and I, but for our guests, it looks great. And we videotape these segments with experts and along with us giving you our updates on what's going on in the market. And we have been pretty much spot on, not to pat ourselves on the back. It's just called uh, watching the market and watching trends. And we have nailed it. We've let you know six months ahead of time when the, we were at the bottom of the market before anybody t- else. And that's a tough one. Yes. Right, because there's other things that we're spot on on that are a little bit easier. Yeah, but like when rates were going to go up. Yeah, but to <laughs> pick the absolute bottom of a market, that was a really tough and one. We that's nailed it. We yeah. nailed it six months before Warren Buffett was willing to throw it out there. Well, that's the thing you mentioned right now is that we were willing to throw it out there when we felt it, when we saw it. We didn't wait for the data to confirm it. Well, that's because we had three people that were listening, and he has millions. <laughs> 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 he has to be a little more conservative. But that's kind of like the way we watch rates. Ask sometime when you're getting a loan, I dare you, ask your mortgage professional um, what economic indicators are going to affect their interest rate in the near future yeah in the next three days in the next three days i guarantee they'll go huh and they'll tell you the 10-year note yeah, which yeah, has yeah. nothing to do with interest rates it just tends to fall it kind of close 70 percent of the time but the other 30 percent could catch you uh paying more interest than you need to taylor i know you follow the market like a hawk I, you you have to i mean the the game of this is to put your client in the best financial scenario. Granted, it's not our decision whether they lock or not, but it sure does feel a lot better when you're giving them professional advice on, on what's going on and what potential factors that day could affect their future home financing. You know, mm-hmm. and that's the thing, too, is you're giving your clients confidence that it is the right time to lock. And, you know, the way I usually explain it is, okay, here's where we're at. Here's the upside. Here's the downside. Do you like the upside compared to the downside? I'm not going to call it a gamble, but it kind of is a little bit because nobody mm-hmm. really knows what's going to happen the next day. So as long as the Making upside... Making an educated guess helps. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So as long as the upside is better than the downside and the chances are that they're going to make a profit this way, then let's do it. And then here's the hardest part, and this is where it's really difficult for us, is when they do well for two or three or five days or even 10 days, okay, Mr. and Mrs. Borrower... You've now made $17,000 at the craps table. It is time to walk away, lock your loan, and pay this payment for the next 30 years. There's got to be a point where you say, I've done really well. I have to lock this loan. I'm not going to risk it anymore because, like we said, coming soon to a theater near you, there's a pullback. Hey, why don't we throw a, a shout-out also to you, to uh, the, your successful closing today and uh, them ringing the, the uh, funding you. bell. Who was that? It was... Uh, Jet Braggison. Um they just closed today, came in and rang their own bell. I think Oh, that was Jet? Yeah. Oh cool. And I think uh the the girls actually let him press enter on the 
funding button. So I think he actually <laughs> funded his own loan. Funded his <laughs> own loan. You don't hear that often. I, I'm not sure that's quite that's compliant, awesome. but all right. <laughs> we, just had, we just had what? Uh, n- uh, Robert and Nova uh, Hussein, Hussein. Yep. Hussein come in and ring the funding bell. So we've now started, and we'd love you to join us on our new Wall of Fame. We have, uh, because there's nothing more satisfying then basically pr- pressing that funding button, have a ring our funding bell, and give them the keys to their new home. I mean, there's nothing like it. Yeah, no, it's absolutely great. And, you know, we've been talking about doing the uh, the Wall of Fame for quite some time, actually, since we opened this office here uh, on Turney Road right by Magic Mountain Parkway. And we didn't quite know exactly what we would put on there or what we would do. And then it just kind of happened naturally, and I think it's great. Well, yeah, well, Robert, actually, yeah. when we said, what do you, what's that noise when they funded the thing, we rang the bell. He goes, I want to ring my own bell. Yeah. <laughs> <We're like It laughs> too, to back up a little bit, too, there's not a lot of mortgage companies where the clients are signing in our office. Our clients are signing in our office. So if they do have questions at signing, there's their mortgage professional that set them up in the next office over here to answer their questions. So I think that's huge. Yeah, we'd love you to join us anytime right here and join our family, our Cherry Creek Mortgage family. It is a an incredible family right off Attorney of Road, right by Valencia Country Club, actually right next to the chamber. Um, you can come by and join us at Cherry Creek Mortgage anytime. It's a happy home here. All right, speaking of happy homes, I don't think there's any better way to help somebody get into a home <laughs> except with zero down. Unbelievable. So we have multiple options. Uh, Taylor, why don't you start with a very unique one that you actually spearheaded for us. And it's impressive because you did the research. This thing's been thrown out there that it's available, but you actually did the research and it's making it happen. Yes, USDA financing. USDA financing is essentially 100% financing, and the seller could pay up to 6% of closing costs. So this is a program where you could get into a property with no money out of your pocket. And this is the United States Department of Agriculture. It's not about beef. Yeah, it's <laughs> not a meat <laughs> No loan. beef rating. It's not for grade A steaks. It's no, no. It's for, for grade property. A loans. It's for grade A loans. So uh, it is it is restricted to, s- excuse me, specific areas, but there, there are areas in the Santa Cruz Valley that do qualify for, for it. For a little limited time, though. It as looks of like anyways. As of right now, it's getting set to expire in October. So if you're on the fence, dial up. There are some opportunities for you. Okay, and then we, Gene, I'll let you touch on the next one because we talked about how much we love our vets, and this is I uh, what we believe is, what do you think, one of the best loans I th- available? I think right now, absolutely, hands down, the best loan in the country, uh, and well-deserved. You know, yes. I feel that our veterans are well-deserved of having the best mortgage in the country. That's a good thing. Uh, what's really nice about it is it's not only that it's zero down. Yes, that's a great feature that it has. <laughs> it would work for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it also has a reduced interest rate relative yep. to the standard market interest rate. And in addition to that, it has very flexible underwriting guidelines. And they're also common sense guidelines. So uh, it's the only product that we have in our product line that takes into consideration whether you pay child care or not. And people say, oh, no, that should make it harder to qualify. No, what that means is we care enough to make sure that you're going to be able to make your payment going forward. Oh, what a concept prior to 2007. (laughs) (laughs) So, (laughs) yes, there's a lot of levels of due diligence, but it also has flexibility for if you have not a perfect credit history. Or um, I'm going to be looking at one now in the next couple of days. I just got a call um, where the veteran is fully disabled, receives a great pension, uh, and has been out of the country for 18 years, so doesn't have any credit. Um, but it's you know pretty legit. You know, he's got verifiable income. He's just been out of the country, so we'll no monthly mortgage insurance. No monthly mortgage insurance. No, the upfront mortgage insurance can be waived if you've been disabled, like this gentleman. Uh, even better. Or financed. Right. So it's still no money out of pocket is quite possible on this product. As yeah, well. with the seller's help, our help, there's a way to get into a home literally for no money out of your pocket. Yeah, and then the only thing, and Taylor, you can help me with this, is it's really important that you have your benefits in line, right? That you've <laughs> that you've actually gone through a certain process and received a certification, done so many hours. Taylor, you're, you're the expert at this. Tell me a little bit more about that. So basically, you want to make sure that you send in for your certificate of eligibility. Certificate of eligibility will let us know what your... Um, uh, dropping a blank here. Will let us know the dollar amount of... Benefits. Benefits available for the VA financing. Okay. So the, the big thing was, though, that it's Entitlement was the word that I was yeah, looking that's for. That's the magic Your word. Your VA entitlement. 
Right. So and and it's a little more difficult to have that if you're a reservist, right? The reservist, you have to meet a different criteria than active duty. So we, that's something that we would do up front for them is with a copy of the DD-214, if you're active duty, we can submit for your certificate of eligibility. See all these acronyms getting thrown out? Yep, Come yep, yep. talk to an expert. We'll help you out. If you're a vet, you should get into a home now. Do it now, too, before rates go up and before sell prices go up because we'd love to get you into a home and we're doing it every month we're helping our vets get into a home and with one of the best financing options available all right we don't want you to go away because we're going to talk about some other opportunities for many of you including again i've written this article there's a window of opportunity for first-time home buyers and move-up buyers that is closing do not miss this opportunity do not miss our next segment on the don and gino real estate and finance show we'll be right back